In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix there was a problem resetting your Windows computer. So there's a few reasons why you may be seeing this error message. So you'll need to go through each of these solutions to find the one that works for you. Now, first step is just to go and open up the command prompt on your window. And we can do that by opening up the start menu and typing in CMD. And then you can right click on the command prompt and run this as administrator. Now, the first thing you need to do is type in RE agent CMD space forward slash disable and then press enter. You should see this text that says operation successful and then we just need to go in re-enable this by typing in reagent c space forward slash enable and then press enter. Now in most cases just doing this alone is enough to go and fix the reset issue. If it's still not working there's a couple more commands we need to go and type into this window. So go and type in sfc space forward slash scan now and press center. This will scan your computer for any corrupted or damaged Windows files. So you'll just need to wait for this verification to get to 100%. And if any corrupted files are detected, it will automatically repair them in this window here. Now, the next thing we need to type in is DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup hyphen image space forward slash restore health and then press enter. Now, once again, you'll just need to wait for this to get to 100%. Once it's finished, you can go and close out of the command prompt. You'll need to try restarting your computer. And once your computer's restarted, that should have now solved the issue. If it's still not working, then open up the start menu and click on settings. In the left hand side, click on system and then scroll down and click on recovery. Now where it says advanced startup, click on restart now and then press the restart now button. Now this will restart your computer and advance recovery. So once you're on this window, you need to go and click on troubleshoot, click on advanced options and then click on startup repair. You can then wait a few minutes while this tries to fix any issues with your system. If it's still not working, you can come back over to the troubleshoot page. You can click on reset this PC. You'll then have the option to remove your files or to keep your files. We're just going to click on keep your files. And once you've gone through these steps, that should have now fixed the resetting issue. Let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful.